This is absolutely the last time I'm recording this. Just, just watch what happens when you redeem the channel point to attack the stables in my minigame. Ta-da! Okay, so this is what it looks like in Atom, right? Arathi Basin minigame. Uh, there are five zones in Arathi Basin. There are five sets of rules in the Arathi Basin minigame. Basically, the whole thing is uh, predicated on a variable, global variable, a status for each one of the points. Uh, they all start at five. If it's from five to, or from six to 10, it's alliance controlled. From four to zero, it's horde controlled. And then the channel points themselves just basically manipulate the numbers up and down. I have uh, a neutral math check rule here that if it's five, it will go back to being uh, gray as, you know, un uncaptured as we're about to witness. So right now the Alliance attacked and it's at six for the stables. The stables, let me go down to the stables. So when the horde attacks right here, it's gonna go back down to five, the stables are gray. If the horde attacks again for a little more channel points, the stables are orange, the horde has assaulted them. If the, they attack, was it four more times? One, attack, two, attack, three, attack, four, attack. The stables are captured by the horde. The, the number can no longer go anywhere because the op option for the horde to attack the stables has gone from my channel points. Only the Alliance can attack the stables right now, which they will do, putting it back into contest. The horde can attack again to bring it back into control. That's the game. Um, each attack against a zone increases the channel point cost to give some resource management to it. Uh, right now, I believe victory will be decided once one side owns majority. So once you hit three, you win. I really wanna find somebody who can code so that I can code in a time-based system for each zone you hold, each second counts a certain number of points. So the more zones you hold, the more points you get, and the first one to like 100 or whatever wins. But I can't do that myself, I can do this. Um, if you're familiar with Adam and you have any uh, comments or concerns, I know this is probably more elaborate than it needs to be, please uh, reach out to me on Twitter or leave a comment and talk to me about it because I'm always learning, I'm always wanting to learn, and I want to make more of these because I think this is a really cool idea. If you play World of Warcraft and this looks cool to you, I and mean, you want to see maybe another battleground done, let me know which one and I'll do a little research and see how I would set that up here in Adam. Yeah, that's the gist of it. If you liked it, please like the video so more people can see it. Uh, I do World of Warcraft and cooking, you know, mixed, whatever. So thanks for watching. Uh, we'll see you next time. I'll show you when it's up and running completely. I'll do another video. I think it'll be pretty cool.